All right, so today in this video, you're going to learn how to install a solo state drive an M2 right into the Asus Predator Helios 300. Let's do that right now. How are we doing, everyone? I'm Dario from MediaBoxNT.com. And today, you're going to learn how to install the one terabyte in this case into the Helios 300. But before that, I need you to subscribe to Media Box CNT by hitting right there in the side. And yes, YouTube doesn't let you know when we're releasing the video. So you have to make sure you hit the notification bell as well too. Why? Because we bring you all the time tech videos like laptops, 3D printers, robotic, and much more cameras and a lot of cool videos. So you need to get notification bell and make sure you subscribe. So now let's go and let's change the drive. All right, so after we remove all the screws, we need to use this tool and right here, right on the border, we're going to put the tool and we're going to press it. It's not an easy thing. We have to open it and release all the clips and then we can pull it back. Okay, and we got it. So make sure you use this, okay? It's very important to be able to uh, remove the top. All right, so we see the laptop right here. All right, so we have the two me uh, uh, memory module. Remember, you can upgrade it up to 32 gigabyte. This one has 16, so you can go all the way to 32. 32 is the limit. So these are the original in a 512 included with the computer, an M2. We can install here a uh, 2.5 solar state drive. And right here, we're gonna install the M2. All right, so my next step is we need to remove the battery and then we're gonna install the memory or the M2 right there. All right, so we finished installing the drive. So the only thing at this point is plug my battery, close the laptop, put it up on Windows 11, and then format the drive. To remind you once again, make sure you follow MediaBox NT by subscribing right there, notification bell, because we're gonna bring you more technology just for you. I'll see you next time, bye.